Alright, we are live. Let's get this. Um Dum da 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 dum da dum Dum da 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 dum da dum <coughs> Let us see, let us see Let us see Coffee? Mm. Coffee? Yeah. Just what I needed. Do that one. I got a bunch of shit that needs to be discovered. Uh, what's this one? Route from Pippins, or did you pick it yourself? <clears throat> Professor Weasley. <sighs> Somewhere away from prying eyes. stopped me and I... Merlin's beard! I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Shall we? After you, Professor. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. I'd only planned to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now, where is Deke? He must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor? The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. This
This presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Splendid. Cast Evanesco on those chairs. Excellent work. Sweet. You'll note that you are now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? This room is huge. Is that... Goodness, my old school bag. I wondered where that had got to. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Yes, Professor. Oh, dear me. Can't you keep it down? Some Revelia, trying to rest. This isn't as precarious as it looks. An intruder! Stop them! No, not... Uh, that's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin! <laughs> Revelia! How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? Hello? What was that? Was that a golden snitch? Oh, it is. Perhaps you should summon the witch and find out. <laughs> Incendio Revelio
Snooks is over there. Oh. Two of those. Fuck me. Incendio. Pavelio. There's a way. Can't decide if I fucking push it out over here or not. This one has got to me stomped. What's up, Douglas? Broomsticks. Trying to think.
Fucking stumped Yeah, I was right. I was just doing it kind of wrong. Because you got to go... another box? Fuck. I think so. These chests and shit were yellow. I think. Fuck, I don't remember. Get all the way back here. It's gonna be something stupid. Yeah, it was just a chest. Alright, because I pulled that one down. Yep. God damn it. God, I'm struggling today. That how self can find us in here. Mm. Well, we just found him. Yikes, careful. Huh? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deed will come to you. 
Hello. Ah, oh, Deke, we've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep-seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the Room of Hidden Things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my <coughs> school without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. to work with. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. <laughs> You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, yes. I'll give you now, a brief lesson time in to country. see if they level the room with might me. might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes. The magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. A A X Y A A X Y A. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm, quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plants and brew potions in class. Wherever? Hmm. 
know what. Give me... Oh, I don't have another talent to use? Fuck. I was going to buy this. Which is whatever. So we'll go like this. Oh, damn it. station with one burner for burning potions. Oh, I can create the style. I can pick the style now, when I can actually see it, cool. That one's pretty cool. Fucking what just happened? Killing me, fucking controller. What does that mean? That one's cool. Well done. You can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Already got one of those.
will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. Can you tell me a bit more about Deke? He's been at Hogwarts longer than I have, and seems to know it's every nook, cranny, and secret. We discovered this room together when I was a student. Deke has had a good deal of experience, both here at Hogwarts and at a previous post. I shall let Deke tell you more when he's ready, but again, you would be wise to listen to any suggestions he may have. Can I use this type of transfiguration magic outside of the room? No. Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. We've charms in place to enforce that. It would be exhausting to reverse the errors in both judgment and magic. But the Room of Requirement has its own rules. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. Well, I can do it all now. <coughs> Dude, this is fucking cool. about
What is disable snapping? I don't understand what that means, so hang on. Hogwarts, let me see. Oh, do they both have a fucking snitch? Decorating, homie. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the room of requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? Thank you. 
Really? I've conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. You can change the colors, patterns, and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. at any conjured item and perform the altering spell to customize it. You're ready for something a little more advanced. You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Thank you. 
<laughs> Alrighty, let's see. Alrighty, that's cool. That's cool. No, no, no. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. Not centered again. Thank you. 
Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? and eerie, as if I'm in the Forbidden Forest, surrounded by shadows. Oh, sounds perfect. That's fucking cool. I want to be able to look at all of them, though. Hmm. Quite a difference. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. What the fuck? space how did that happen the room equips itself to your needs it must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting if you'd like to customize the space further you can use these spell crafts you'll find more of them both inside and outside the school thank you professor i shall keep an eye out good i'll leave you to it this is your space now use Bro, it i must spend like four days in here to never be in here Where's Deke? There he is. <coughs> ask you about changing the room's ambiance. I want to see them all. Huh? What sort of overall look most appeals to you? I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Oh, sounds perfect. I actually kind of like that one more. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I'd like the room to be warm and comfortable, as if I'm floating inside a mug of butterbeer. Oh, sounds perfect. That's the first one. Yeah. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Uh, 
What sort of overall look most appeals to you? I'd like the room to feel natural and earthy, as though I'm outdoors. Hmm, oh, sounds perfect. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? Mm, I'd like the room to feel mysterious and eerie. As if I'm in the forbidden forest, surrounded by shadows. Oh, hmm, sounds perfect. Guess. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambiance. Of course. Eh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Hmm, oh, sounds perfect. Yeah. That's the one.
Dude, this is actually pretty fucking cool.
And they've got stuff. I don't have Bombarda yet, so we'll have to do this one.
Alright, give me a second.
back. Back, back, back. Let's go here. What? Oof, da da da. Let's do this. And then. <coughs> Whoa. So, the astronomy wing has. No. I want. I wish these would tell you. <coughs> Whoa. So let's exit. This is astronomy wing. Really? There it goes. Enter room of requirement, which will be BAM. Cool. Well, it takes me straight here. I can go outside. Uh, yeah, no, nope. we can go here, right? How do I summon my broom? Uh, bam. Um. You'd think it would be in the tool menu. <laughs> Imelda Rays? I'll be weak sent me. <coughs> <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me? Slytherin Quidditch captain. Jealous of you? Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. You're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Enough of this. Uh, Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. Slytherin versus Ravenclaw. Can you tell me more about these courses? St stalling, fifth year. Fine, I'll humor you. This course demands focus. Requires you to anticipate speed and height before every turn. The others test stamina. Three courses in all. Built ages ago by former students. 
Since Black cancelled Quidditch, it was these courses or nothing. I made them popular again, got the whole school hungry to compete. So, let's see what you've got, fifth year. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. Alright, so, do we just jump into it? I don't know. Did it! Whoa! Excellent! Oh, I forgot. Woo! Out of control! How do I... We'll just keep going, huh? Got a little wild there for a little bit, but we figured we, oh, we honed it in. Ugh, that's not. You, you must have cheated. You. Ugh. Fine. You won. <sighs> Don't think this is over. Gang, gang, you bitch. can't determine skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Uh, you're not terrible, but you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Challenge accepted, then. Perhaps you have what it takes after all. We shall see. But don't get your hopes up. The next course near Irondale offers a much tougher challenge. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium, where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. <sighs> Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fared. Mm -hmm. He will, I believe, give me an upgrade now, right? Bum, ba -da -dum, ba -da -dum, ba -dum, bum. Handy resource <coughs> indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Oh, you're back! We've something to report, I hope. <coughs> Mr. Weeks, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray's must have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent and is wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Hmm, that's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my works had potential all along. Why would anyone doubt your ability to upgrade brooms? Oh, you'd be surprised. People get set in their ways, worry that fiddling with what's working fine will somehow ruin it. <sighs> 
Those people don't appreciate the sense of freedom that comes with quality broom flight, nor do they appreciate all that's involved in the creative process. I have a friend in Rome runs a shop like mine, says it's worse there. <laughs> of course, they do nap in the afternoons from what I hear. And where would we be without enhancements? I mean, if Elliot Smethick had let the naysayers get to him, we would never have had the cushioning charm. I don't listen to him. I'm excited to hear more. I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Hmm. How to address the issue of altitude as it relates to speed? This one might not actually show me. Dun, da, 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 da. Bum, ba, da, 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 da. Ah, that's cool. It doesn't actually tell me then. Um, ba -dum, dum, da -da -dum. I believe that's hogs meat in the background, though. So, I should be able to go like this. What? It's the castle. Up my bridge? No, that's that's my bridge. All right. or not. I wish I could free look. might be it here. Let's see. 
Lumos. Enchanted candles. Wonder where they're heading. The candles seem to be leading into the Forbidden Forest. must be nearby. Here. I suppose the picnic in the Forbidden Forest could... Hmm. Treasure hunting suits me. Travel broadens the mind. I'm not here to meet Sebastian. Damn it, this is what I want. Not too far away. Then we'll do the lava splash. Ah, <sighs> oh, yes, 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 yes. Hang on. Let me see. <sighs> okay. So that's zero. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine. And eight, seven, six, five, right? One, two, three, four, five. Nine and five. Should be a unicorn. Oh, 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 oh. It smells like flogger worm. Oh. And then... Eleven and uh, zero, one, two, which is thirteen. Which be eight. It's a spider. All right. Zero, one, two. Two and eleven is thirteen. Which needs eight. Okay, so nine. Five is fourteen. Three. Should be the three headed dragon. I tried to send a note to someone I like. I thought the boy oh, was trying to finally have an answer as to why.
Well, you know what I didn't do? Oh, that's cool. Rebellion. That's all that was in here. Ooh. Hello. That sneeze was, uh, intense. What are you up to now? My father said you were hiding. Have you finished your assignments? I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. I trust you are meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. Yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way, but you... I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent and resolve are a potent combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. Now, let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. Focus. Defindo can be dangerous right. if you're not paying attention. X, X, Y. Hmm. Very good. It seems you have a grasp on Defindo. I would encourage you once again to practice here in the classroom. For your sake and that of everyone else. to have a student who actually heeds instructions. As I mentioned earlier, Defindo can be versatile but dangerous. Good to see you continuing to practice. See, it gets a uh, wispy shit when it's done, right? Yep. All right, time to go talk to Sebastian. Chat got disconnected. You got so many people watching me, bro. Over here. Mm. It's noise. Oh, shit. Before we get going anywhere, we got the key. Annoying. 
Nope. Well, not that one. It's the next one. Yeah. <sighs> Thank you. Over here. Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. This way. There's a secret passage just here. It's well disguised. Hmm. How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play gobstones here all the time. Revelia. With my sister, Anne. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep it between us. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. We used to sneak in here almost daily. We've never been caught. I think I've seen Ominous in potions. Or was it Herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. Hmm. I've never heard anyone else speak of it. And I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets. But this place is special to him. Understood. But why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Hmm. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. Ominous cannot abide them, as he'll be the first to tell you. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to, away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the Blasting Curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, mm. I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. But you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. This must be where I learn. It may the take a while to get the feel curses. for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Very well. Y A A X. You're getting it. I guess Ready I to don't actually know. try it out? Uh, Stick to the targets, yeah. though. 
Ooh, I do have four. The Undercroft intact. Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their fingers. Nice work. How's it feel? It's a tad hot. That's it. I think I've got it. Well done. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. There's more where that came from. Been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. I haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do... Perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could come along. Meet Anne. She could use some cheering up. Just let me know when, and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. I assume it's to do with what you told me. About the port key and Gringotts and Ranrock. Nothing gets past you. And yes, it is. As I'm sure you suspect, there is a bit more to all of this. I'm listening. You must promise to keep this between us. I trusted you with knowledge of the secret Undercroft. You can trust me. All right. I can see traces of ancient magic. Ancient magic? I don't know what I was expecting you to say, but it wasn't that. What does that even mean? Honestly, I'm not entirely certain. All I know is that I can see whispers of an old magic that hardly anyone else can. Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that Goblins may be wielding some sort Fuck of wizard magic? Up. That's what we're trying to find out. And this ability of yours, does this allow you to wield this magic too? I... I don't know. Well, when you do know, tell me. I've been studying archaic forms of magic for ages. Perhaps we can help each other. In the meantime, with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, I suspect a bit more time practicing the blasting curses in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you an owl. Confringo! Incendio! Definitely becoming a little bit of a badass. Not going to lie. Dude, I hope they do some fucking dope-ass DLC with this game. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. Oh, shit. You there. I can hear you. Oh, hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together, and... Herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? That room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Sebastian told you, didn't he? You breathe a word about this place to anyone, and not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the Headmaster. I am not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. Trust me, Ominous. I won't say a word. And Sebastian is a good friend. You shouldn't immediately assume the worst of him. 
I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. You're a douche. Ominous, I just meant... I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. Yep, that's your fault. And the shadow of the undercraft. Oh. I would like to teach you Wingardium Leviosa. Oh, fuck yeah. It can be used to levitate objects for a short time. Once you've completed a few prerequisite tasks, do yeah. see me after class. What prerequisites must I have? Map chamber. Multiple enemies simultaneously. Hmm. Um, oh, you did talk to me. Of course it was. Of course it was. That'll be fucking dope. So let's see. That's pretty sick too. Um, room of requirement. Now that I have that, do we want to? Oh, this just adds shit to stuff, huh? Pretty cool. Mm, um, fuck. Do I want to do that or do I want to use. I don't have any of those unlocked. I kind of want to do this one. You know what? Give me this. I will I'm gonna have to. I probably won't even be able to do anything with that one, honestly. I'll just have to change it when I go into there to do shit, I bet. Fuck. Rebellion. Mm. 
It's probably above me. Lumos. If you could just tread carefully, that's all I ask. Revelio. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. It is crazy, I'm still finding new places in the castle. Revelio. It'll be above me. Must be. Let's go back through here. Pavelia. And now it stops. Catch a whiff of anything, I mean, should... Nice to see you, my young friend. Further upstairs we go. Revelio. A bunch of shit over here. <gasps> it's another one of those doors. Yes. Four plus one is five, so we need seven. Nine, eight, seven. So we need the squid on the double. Three and 
zero, so I need two, which will be the goat head. Gotta be up there in that room. Clocked. This is just the astronomy tower. Revelio. Right. other side of the castle pretty fucking lit too <gasps> oh it's a cat It's gone. Just like that. Just gone. Pavelia. Patronus, huh? Then it's not any of those. What you'd want to know. Come over here to this side. Where's this sister lead? Revelia. What are you up to now? Nothing. Pavelio. Are we going upstairs? Rebellion. 
Once I get these fucking locks. Sphinx. You gotta be somewhere near her. Sphinx and a big plant. I don't see either. Revelio. It's in this room. Revelia. It's the werewolf. There it is. Ah, just slow. Another one? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Excellent. 
I need six more? Damn. Damn! Revelio. Stairs gotta be in there. I've always said that travel. Book back to there. Blah, 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 blah. That's right. If I ever remember how to get back down here, it's crazy how fucking big the castle is, though. Like I'm legit just still exploring it. I can go... where am I? I'm down there. Oh yeah, I can't get through that door, that's right. Revelia. There'll be shit in there. Fucking idea how to get up to it, though. Rebellion. thing is there's a butterfly there right where am I bro I see it so I can't get to it without that got it Go it, go it, go it. Towers. 
That's gotta be the astronomy tower then, right? No. Bro, I really wish there was a fucking free look while you're on the broom. Can't I dismount there? That is dumb. Revelia. Who doesn't like heroics? Well, I want. Let's go back down into the dungeon. There was some shit in there that I did not grab. Oh, fuck. You know what, three spaces? Fuck. Let's go sell. Another adventure, are we? Pretty though. Not saying I don't cast the odd spell when no one's not here. My plan is to have enough galleons Come in, look around, and if you've been eating chocolate frogs, please refrain from touching. So. So. I expect you have a sharp eye for that. Twenty-three, and I get. Mm. Nine. So let's see what he has for sale. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. I've heard that our dear Clementine drew you into her butterfly escapades. Unusual girl. Still, it takes all sorts. You won't be disappointed. That's a glad rags promise. You won't be disappointed. That's a glad rags promise. You have a sharp eye.
Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. You won't be disappointed. That's a glad rag's promise. I suspect you have a sharp eye. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. gonna sell it. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Oh wait, fuck. I suspect you have a sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Rebellion. I've heard that our dear A butterfly escapades. Unusual bird. Still, it takes all sorts. Be with you in a bit. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. No one can say I don't keep a stacked shelf.
Rebellion. Rebellion. Remember clicking that all the way. That's it? You don't want to shave your sides? Why? Huh? You don't have to? I didn't say you had to, I just said you didn't shave your sides. I do not understand. Oh. I wonder if I... That was not it. Whoops. Let me 
Lumos. I'm coming here. I don't think any of this shit's gonna be close to my level now, anyways. Popping up on my level. Not that it's worth a fuck, but. At least I can say I tried! So... What's up? There was another. I don't think so. Revenia. This was just a battle. That's to. Oh, it's the other side. This is the painting, right? Bum ba da bum ba da. Right. The map of chamber. Fucking. <sighs> Where's your mother? Huh? Oh, yeah? Is that what she told you? Huh? Not time. Revenia. Uh. 
God damn. Uh, we'll save it in here. Probably call it a day. Dum ba dum ba dum ba da dum ba dum ba da dum ba dum. 